Hey guys, so Rivian just came out with a new update, 2023.50.1, and in that update, there is a new feature called Regenerative Brake Assist. So if you don't know what that is, I'm gonna explain that coming up. So on this new update, 2023.50.1, uh, Rivian has added a feature called Regenerative Brake Assist. So if we just read through this, the new Regenerative Brake Assist feature improves deceleration performance in cold climates on long downhills and in vehicle high states of charge by blending more consistently and seamlessly with standard braking. And if you want to disable it, you can go here. So what that basically means, if that's kind of gibberish to you, is it all has to do with regen braking. So if we look at our driver screen here, this portion is the regen portion. So you'll notice like when you let off the go pedal, what I call it, you'll see the green here and your regen will slow your car down. So what happens is when it's cold outside or the battery is kind of cold, sometimes regen will be limited. And so you'll know because on this regen bar, you'll see that a part of it is shaded. So just depending on the battery or whatever, it could be like the entire thing. It could be like 75%, 50%, whatever. And so when that happens, if you do full one pedal driving, um, when you let off the go pedal or you, you know, decelerate, uh, for me, this happens basically every time I have regen because I always forget and we don't have regen. The, the car is not really cold where I live or it's not very cold where I live. So it doesn't happen too often, so that's why I always forget. So basically what happens is if you have limited regen um, and I'm driving around and I always forget this when it happens, is I'll let off the go pedal like I have full regen. And then basically what happens is the car kind of jerks forward and, you're co and you coast because the regen can't slow the car down as much as you want it to or, or as much as you're anticipating. And so kind of not a good experience. And then you have to like, you know, hit the brake and it's jerky and stuff. And so that's where this feature comes in. So it's super nice because then you don't have to worry about regen at all or a limited regen. You can just drive the car exactly the same as if you have full regen all the time, even if you have limited regen. So basically what it does is you can drive the car and decelerate, let off the go pedal, just like you normally would with one pedal driving. But when you have regen limited over here, what happens is the car obviously knows this. And what it'll do is as you let off the go pedal at the rate that you want to, um, assuming that you have full regen, if the regen bar is limited, what will what'll, what'll happen is the brakes will actually kick in as well. And it says blended on here somewhere, right? Yeah, blending more consistent and seamlessly with standard braking. So basically it'll use as much regen as possible that you have, and also blend the brakes in there with it. So that way when you decelerate or let off the go pedal like you would with full regen, the car will still feel the same. So it's like you have full regen when you don't. And so it's a super nice feature. Uh, Tesla has had it for quite a while now, and I'm, I'm really glad that uh, Rivian has implemented it because it's, it's really nice and then you don't have to worry about trying to remember, oh, I have, like limited regen right now. Let me compensate by, you know, letting off the go pedal earlier. And then you've got the whole coasting thing and all that. And then you have to use the brake pedal as well. It's just either way, you can just drive the car like you're full one, one pedal driving and the car does the rest. So that's basically what this feature does. Again, super nice. Um, and if you do want to disable it for some reason, you don't like it, it's right here. You go into settings. So Settings is right here. If, if it's not on this bar, you can flip this up and then you can hit the settings button. Then you go to vehicle, driver plus, and then regen braking as brake assist is all the way at the bottom of that screen. So if you want to disable it, but yeah, it's a super nice feature. I really like it because it just, it's super seamless and then you can just drive the car like full one pedal driving all the time, even if you don't have the full regen. So it's really nice that it's just blended. The brakes are blended like that and you're good to go. So obviously it's gonna be a nice thing on long downhills too. I've seen a lot of people talk about that where it's like, oh, like my regen is like limited because I'm going downhill so much and it, like the battery's kind of full already and doesn't want to do anymore. So 
like then you have to compensate again with brake pedal. So with this feature, you don't have to do that. You can just drive it like it's one pedal driving and you're good to go. So that's the feature. Hopefully that was helpful. Hopefully that kind of helps you understand how it actually works. Um, if you have any comments, let me know below. And thanks for watching.